harassment because my shorts were too short. So, yeah. I decided not to put short shorts on now. Definitely not harassment. Um, definitely, no. I have not ever had, I never had to experience that, unfortunately. In general, I don't think, um, usually people will tell me in certain areas, like, oh, don't wear that. But I do kind of um, do that for myself sometimes. Sometimes people will say things or comment about my appearance or my clothing, and it really bugs me. Um, I've been catcalled. I if I was free from judgment, I think that I would wear a lot more shorts, I would wear a lot more tank tops, I think I would wear um, clothing with more pictures of musical artists that I like. Maybe I'd wear more rainbow stuff. Or... A lot of people are just really hateful towards things that they don't understand. I always try to choose clothes that don't have assigned pronouns to them, like t-shirts are pretty flamboyant, but things like dresses are assigned with a feminine pronoun. Well, one day I went to school wearing a dress and I was misgendered a lot because of my long hair and the fact that I was wearing a dress. And it just made me feel like people didn't really consider like how I felt. I was told that I should not be wearing a dress because I am a boy and that was not okay with me. Well, in elementary school I was on, I was playing on the play structure and a kid came up to me and started well, like, pulling on my clothes and telling me that I should not be wearing that. I should be wearing t-shirts and pants like boys should. When I'm traveling on public transportation to an event where I have to wear formal wear, I tend to try to be more, like, as casual as possible, like, zip a, jack zip a jacket on top of my outfit or, I don't know, even go as far as wearing a change of clothes and just changing at the event because you always get a lot of stares and uh, people whispering under their breath or you know just looking at you over their shoulder and it makes you feel self-conscious you know it just I don't like it but if I'm going to a crowded area I automatically think I don't want to attract any attention to myself I can't wear a crop top I can't wear shorts I can't wear heels and that isn't right Really in this day and age, I feel like you can you can wear fully clothes and you're still going to get wrapped. So like, it really doesn't matter what, what you actually wear. It just, you know, people are just going to harass you regardless, it seems like, you know. If you're a beautiful person, you can have on the most raggediest clothes. You can have on pajamas. You can have on a big, the beautifulest garment. Someone's going to cat call you or say something to you because it's the way you carry yourself. Well, as for me, I chose the, the crazy casual look because I saw that if I wore jeans or a hoodie or something like that, it's almost nine times out of 10 that an officer will stop me, they want to search me, they want to question me, and if I don't have anything in that's on me that they can use against me, then they tend to just, well, I know. I know. I'll write you a lottery ticket. I'll write you a ticket. I do this to you. I put you back in the car. I sit you in the car like three, four hours while I just sit there and play with your ID card. You know, and things stuff like that. But the minute I stuff a suit, a tie, some slacks, cactus button downs, and no problem. I walk right past, no harassment or anything like that. Or in little questions. Those are the points of where it's almost unnoticeable. I think if you you're um, nice to people, then your outfit doesn't matter. 